my God. Hi everyone, um, my name is Ivan Obwache and um, everything started, my connection with Papa, my relationship with Papa started um, when I visited a friend of mine in Kumasi. It was very late in the night and I met him, I saw him on the television. Uh, frankly speaking, when I saw him ministering it, uh, it was very shocking to me, his style of prophetic and his humility in ministering with the grace of God upon his life attracted me and because of that I couldn't sleep for that whole night. I spent the night there and um, I had to make sure that I was always glued to the television anytime um, I turn on my TV set. So I developed this interest to promote this ministry way back from Kumasi <laughs> until I got to school. Ben, 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 ben. So this account, the Divinity Humanity, Dr. Ojeba, is actually the third account I have created on TikTok to promote this ministry. Actually, I have created two accounts. The first one was uh, blocked due to community guidelines, violation of community guidelines. And the second one also blocked, it was a fate, the same fate. However, it didn't um, stop me from promoting the man of God because uh, I know people do not know him very well. People may assume that he's not that friendly. To be very frank with you, my trip with him on this uh, journey to South Africa has opened my eyes to know him very, very well. He's very friendly. He's so, so much lovely. His environment, you cannot escape being with him because anytime you are with him, he will make you laugh and uh, he will also inspire you. And I thank God for meeting such a great man of God. It's actually one of the greatest privileges that I have made in my lifetime. And way back in the in the transformation factory um, around last year, December Friday, it was um, a great um, time because I never expected that Papa would acknowledge me in that diplomatic um, style. Hey, if you know, also, for the now for man, for man, it's something small to buy data for what you are doing. I do appreciate the oil. It was something that I never expected, and I thank God for His life, and I thank God for anyone who also has taken upon himself to promote Papa and uh, His ministry. God bless you. All. A guy who is not a pastor here doing evangelism. Meanwhile, he attends church, different church. And when you look at his videos, he has never added his own video. Ne mami video ni ho, ne papa video ni ho, ne sofu video ni ho, ne bushu ni biya video ni ho. Onu anka sakuran sumpi a video biya to ho. Every ten minutes biya mu alo do video. Every ten minutes na wo ma kafshen ne wo mu alo de me pecha beto ho. Nu akanchi ramu se insurance mbe na mu anka fanchi ramu ne mu kofu. My account papa minimum time, you should the data every ten minutes be a load of video. Every ten now you can see set over time and so much at the end of the So it got to a point whereby I wanted to test him, and so I used different accounts and I started chatting with him, and I was like, Dr. Jaba. I want to support your ministry. What say? Enya me me no jaba no. Na me papa no no. Enu ti sa wo pa. Na wo de asori ha number e de amani pa no. No wa man direction.
right, so um, while I was posting this content on TikTok, uh, one day I saw a message from uh, the Stacey Ojaba, his main handle, and I was shocked. I was so, so, so surprised. The message was, can I get your number? I was like, wow, seriously. So I didn't know that the state here has been monitoring my account for a while. So I gave him my contact and I thank him for sending me that particular message. Um, within a couple of days, his um, assistant contacted me that Papa would like to meet me on a special program. I was very, very uh, much excited. And I got to the church that very particular evening. <coughs> I was assisted by his uh, personal assistant. Who is, the, who is in the person, um, Miss Anita. She's endowed with uh, people handling skills and I really appreciated the reception she gave me. It was so uh, top notch. And wherever she is at this moment, I want to thank her for that opportunity he gave to me. So many nay and couple. God will bless you, God will bless you, God will bless you. Hi. When I'm traveling to South Africa, I will go with you. Alright, so um, when Miss Anita uh, met me at the gate, uh, she took me inside and offered me a seat. And while service was going on, Papa mounted a pulpit and uh, called me out. Uh, in ministration, he acknowledged my record as I initially said, and also he promised that he would uh, take me to South Africa. And here I am, I'm actually in South Africa as I speak with you, with him, with him and also his story. It's a marvelous experience with him. Can't lie. Papa is actually um, a very calming personality. He has a very calming personality. And he's also very, very friendly. Everyone would love to be with him because he always creates an environment that you will never, ever forget about. All right, I want to also use this opportunity to thank um, someone very special to me. Someone um, under whose guidance and oversight enabled me to also read this thing. Uh, Brother Simon, um, I met him on TikTok. He's also um, he's the one who is handling um, Ojaba TV on TikTok. He contacted me specially and also promised that he was also going to guide me throughout. And anytime I reach out to him that I need this, I need a particular content, I want to push this. He's always there for me, and wherever he is, I want to also especially thank him um, because he's a brother. I didn't know that he has a, um, a good thing, a supportive team. I want to also mention um, International J1, whom I met on this trip, and he has also been a very good friend to me. Thank you very much, J1, and everyone who works collaboratively to make this um, ministry a success. The security team, I want to also mention the protocol team. I want to mention the entire Presbyteria uh, membership. Everyone that makes it possible that that is ministry would go far for everyone to see the prophetic culture.
have a special message for Daddy. Daddy has shown me great love and other people as well. And I pray that he will never lack in the name of Jesus. I also, especially, want to say that may his horns be exalted like the horn of the unicorn. And that may the oil of gladness come upon his head, so that he will be exalted above his fellows. Nabi, you have shown me something that nobody has shown me before. Even if someone has shown me that this particular love, yours is unique. Because I have never seen or met a man like you. God bless you so much.